Tonight, hundreds of children's photos have been stolen. Spectrum Health estimates around 900 pediatric patients' pictures and their information are missing. That's right. It's all because a doctor's car was broken into. New tonight, 24 Hour News 8's Heather Walker is finding out what Spectrum is doing to prevent this from happening to your information. Spectrum Health tells us that the camera that was stolen was a physician's personal property and should have never been used on patients. Why was the personal camera used? Yeah, that's a great question. Our policy is not to use personal cameras. We have special equipment to do this, uh, and this was done outside of our policy. Physicians taking pictures of children's moles, rashes, and other skin conditions is within the policy. Spectrum says it's a way for dermatologists to monitor care. But the pictures should have been taken on Spectrum equipment and secured. I'm a parent. The thought of my children's photograph being out there, even if it was their leg, I wouldn't like that. The president of Spectrum Health Medical, Dr. Daryl El Mushi, says the pictures included the kids' names, dates of birth, and medical record numbers. Some may have children's faces. The patients were seen at the Helen DeVos Children's Hospital Dermatology Clinics in Grand Rapids and Lansing from mid-February of this year to June 22nd when the car was broken into. It's now over a month. Why did it take so long to notify? Yeah, that's a great question. It took us a long time to actually make sure we had all of our ducks in a row in terms of making sure we knew all the patients that potentially were involved. We had to go back through three months worth of records. Spectrum says it's now contacted all of the families affected. What changes are being put in place to ensure that this doesn't happen again? So we are constantly educating our providers and our staff about privacy measures. And when something like this comes out, it's an example of why we have to follow these. Now, Spectrum would not disclose the name of the doctor or talk about any repercussions if you think that your child may be affected by this. We have links up right now at woodtv.com. Reporting in Grand Rapids, Heather Walker, 24-Hour News 8.